Hi everyone, this is a week um, 21 update. I uh, just wanted to give a really quick update on reaching 21 weeks. I am really excited and happy that I've got this far because as um, those of you know who've watched my videos, um, because of my history, um, every day, every week is like a bonus and um, it just makes me think, you know, we're getting there. And um, really, I'd just like to reach healthily, um, well, any as far as I can go, def, def, obviously, but definitely to week 31, 32, at least. Um, you know, obviously then I'll know that, you know, um, the baby will be healthier and safer. Um, so this is the second time, this is my fifth pregnancy, and the second time I've reached this far, which is really, like, really good. Um, how I felt over the last couple of days, the last few days, I felt really um, sad, depressed, down, fed up. Um, lots of different reasons. I've just been really, really moody and hormonal and picky and everything. It's like my husband just can't do anything right. Um, and that's worse than normal. But um, one of the, the other reasons is because I really, really, really want a girl. And I know that a lot of people are saying, I'll oh, just be happy with whatever you get. And, um, you know, just pray for a healthy baby and be glad you've got this far. But I really, I don't know why, but I really desperately want a girl. And I really desperately feel that it's a boy. And I was just... Um, I was just feeling really down about it and I was crying and everything and just really upset about it and I know there's nothing I can do about whether it's a boy or a girl and I know that whether it's a boy or a girl I'm going to love it and you know um, cherish it and I've got a son already and I absolutely adore him so I have nothing against boys it's just um, I just want a girl this time round um, I haven't brought anything girly particularly. I've bought a few things, but nothing major. Um, but I really would like a girl, and it's just to the point where I, you know, I have to find out at the next scan the gender, what it is, whether it's a boy or a girl, only because I want a girl so badly that if I wait till I get to term and they hand me this little boy and say, oh, you've got a baby boy, um, I might not bond and I don't want to be a mother that doesn't bond. I mean, I'm not saying that whether it's a girl or a boy, I, I will definitely bond. But, you know, I don't want to risk, I don't want to do anything that might risk me not bonding. So if I find out that it's a boy sooner, then obviously, it will, you know, I'll have all that time to bond while I'm buying all these little clothes and getting his room ready and everything. I'll, you know, all help with the bonding process. Um, and so that's all I want to do. Just find out whether it's a boy or a girl as soon as I can. Um, I've been having lots and lots and lots and lots of gas pains. And I find that when I'm getting it really bad, my stomach tightens up at the top, especially. I mean, right now he's lying, and I say he because that's what I've always called him. He's lying around my belly button area. But right at the top. Um, gets really tight and it really really it doesn't hurt it's just really uncomfortable um, and I can't breathe properly and stuff but um, I get that and I've had like obviously the pains I've had before my lower back I've had those pains as well um, but nothing else I mean generally speaking this pregnancy has been really good the first few weeks obviously up until 12 weeks or so 13 weeks had a lot of nausea but I didn't actually have any throwing up really but I had a lot of nausea but as compared to some um, pregnancies and some women I think I've had it pretty easy and compared to some of my previous pregnancies where I've actually lost them I've had this has been a really good pregnancy and I'm really happy about the way things have gone so far um, Next week, Tuesday, less than a week before I have my next scan and I find out 
whether it's a boy or a girl I can't wait every time I think about it I get all like my throat goes tight and I get all nervous so I try not to think about it but I've been waiting for it for so long that I can't help thinking about it um, so I'm looking forward to that uh, and nothing else really um, brought some paint today to paint the baby's room but I'm just going to do it a magnolia cream colour and then add um, stencils on the wall depending on whether it's a boy or a girl and then do some window dressings um, the reason I'm going to do it that way is because children change so quickly and I don't want to add anything that's going to be really hard to take away later and when my son was born I went to town with his room and um, obviously we moved house when he was two so I had to leave it all behind and now he he would hate me to put those things, I mean he's six and he would hate me to put those things in his room now I mean I suppose I could decorate again but don't want to if I can help it um, and that's about it really um, another quite non-eventful week um, nothing much to report I um, hope to put up a little video of the room as it is at the moment and then um, another one when I've done a bit more and there's more things in it and um, can't think of anything else but anyway um, that's it I think and hope to do another video soon and let you know whether it's a girl or a boy. Until then, take care. Bye.